I actually think Eloy Jimenez is a little bit underappreciated. You just don't see guys come along this often with this kind of combination of hitting ability and power. I mean, we're talking about a guy who could hit 320. He could hit in that ballpark, 35-plus homers. He could win home run titles. He could win batting championships. Just a very, very special, special hitter. Now, there's another guy we'll talk about in a minute who I think overshadows him a little bit. But this guy, he's one of the best right-handed hitters you've seen come along in years. Yeah, and it's just it's that easy power. You know, that you've heard that term. It's just so easy. He doesn't swing too hard. He doesn't sell out. He sees pitches. He's got a good approach. He's a pretty good outfielder, too, by the way. Let's not forget that he's actually a complete player. But the offensive combination of skills is just off the charts good. And he should be in, in Chicago on opening day. If I'm filling out a lineup card, I want him in the middle of my lineup from the start of the season. And here's what it might look like. We got a chance to see a little bit of clips at him, but let's do a little breakdown on, on him and Ez because you guys are right. I mean, the first thing that stands out is the size. 6'4", 205, and then you're 22 years old. The guy's ready for the big leagues. But he's got power to all fields. I love the fact he faced big leaguers in spring training, had a monster spring, the opportunities he got, and then he carried it over to the minor leagues. But that power opposite way is just so impressive. And he's at lefties, righties, it doesn't matter. Can play some defense as well. He's got great range. He's continuing to grow. But I, I, I'm just really impressed. Every time you see him, he seems to get better. 